a former finance manager at the Water Resources Management Authority, has today been sentenced to 24 years in jail for soliciting and receiving bribes of up to 910,000 Kenya shillings to facilitate development in the authority's regional offices. Now, in the judgment that was delivered by senior principal magistrate Eunice Nutu of the Ethics and Anti-Corruption Court, James Ambuso was found guilty of four out of the nine counts of bribery and abuse of office that faced him and was given an alternative fine of 7.6 million Kenya shillings. Laura Otieno tells us more. With the accused person's demands. Appearing before senior principal magistrate Eunice Nyoto at the Milimani Anti-Corruption Court on Tuesday, James Ambuso, who served as a finance manager at the Water Resources Management Authority, was slapped with a 24-year jail term or an alternative fine totaling 7.6 million shillings for soliciting and receiving bribes 10 years ago. Amboso was facing nine offences under the Bribery Act of 2016 and the Anti-Corruption and Economic Crimes Act of 2003. He was convicted on four counts. On the offence of corruptly soliciting for 340,000 shillings benefit from one Geoffrey Moria between May 2012 and February 2013, Ambuso was slapped with a 1 million shillings fine and a three-year jail term as well as a mandatory fine of 890,000 shillings and three years in jail. Also convicted on the second count of receiving a benefit to facilitate disbursement of funds to Warmas Mombasa's regional office, the former manager was given an additional 1 million shillings fine or three years behind bars and a monetary fine of 890,000 shillings or an extra three years in jail. Ambuso was also found guilty of soliciting 375,000 shillings from one Boniface Moniki between December 2012 and April 2013 and was slapped with a 1 million shillings fine or a three-year jail term alongside a mandatory fine of 930,000 shillings or a three-year default. On the count of corruptly receiving a benefit, the former manager was slapped with a 1 million shillings fine and a three-year default alongside a mandatory fine of 930,000 shillings or a three-year jail term alternative. The overall fine totaling to a whooping 7,640,000 shillings or a 24-year jail term as a sentence is to be served consecutively. With the accused person's demands, Amboso took plea on the 10th of April 2019 and is acquitted on two counts of bribery and three counts of abuse of office. The court rejected the accused's plea to pay the fine in installments while at home and directed that he files a formal application demonstrating how he would pay the amount. Laura Otieno, Citizen TV.